Okay, so the next thing you guys wanted to discuss was something that a lot of people were talking about over the weekend. And it's this thing between Irene and Jenny. And what Irene did was great, but I also think it was pretty genius on her part. See, whether this was on purpose or not, Irene is just a good person and knows what to do. Obviously, there's been a lot of, I don't know, let's just say talk and discussion around Jenny lately. And over the weekend, that was pretty much gone. So a few days ago, we see a clip of Irene turning around on stage to walk Jenny back because she knew that Jenny would be alone. Irene always having to take care of four other girls just has that instinct now. And then the next day, we start seeing them reference each other's dances. We see them celebrating together, which makes my eyes just sweat a little bit, you know? But more importantly, it got everyone's attention. And because of that, for me personally, it's hard not to think that Irene did these things on purpose for Jenny. She's smart, and you can tell there's always a lot going on in her mind. And I'm pretty sure that she knew by doing these things, it changes the narrative around Jenny. I mean, just look what everybody's talking about now. If not for the long term, at least for a little bit. And another thing is that Irene knows what it's like to be criticized. And how hard that can be, especially when you're promoting alone. You know, seeing all this happen in the last couple of days, it's just, it's just good to know that in a such... In such a competitive industry, where things can get petty and spiteful, that these artists are willing to have each other's backs. And the relationship between members in the same group or just different groups together, these relationships are a big reason I think that we fell in love with K-pop in the first place. Okay, so the next thing on Twitter...